Hey guys, this is Bharadwaj with phonearena.com and this is the Nokia X and I am back again to let you know how to root the Nokia X after it was updated to 11.1. So recently Nokia updated the uh, firmware on this to Nokia X platform 11.1. As you can see, this is the uh, about page which will tell you the platform version which is 1.1 and the software version is 11.1.1. So this is uh, different than 10 in which there was a security hole that we exploited, uh, we all exploited to root our phones. But uh, after the update it has been fixed but there is yet another way to exploit this. So that is what we are going to see in this video how to root the Nokia X in the latest software update. So we have already rooted uh, this and unrooted this so you are going to see all the steps right away. What you do first is that you make sure you update your phone. It should be on 11.1.1 the software version and then uh, mainly you have to go into developer options inside the settings and enable USB debugging. So that is uh, definitely mandatory if you want to do the routing. So last time we did one click root from the phone but this time it's going to be a little bit more complicated, a very tiny bit more complicated and we are going to do it on the PC. So what you see here is a Windows 8 machine uh, and uh, I'm going to connect the phone over USB with USB debugging enabled. So let me see. So as you can see now the Nokia X device is connected and it will show up as mass storage. Uh, but also you can see in the device manager that it shows up as the other devices in the Nokia X. Now this guide is possible because of another thread in XDA. So this guy has rooted the device with another method and that's what we are exactly using. So the package as you can see now on the screen is from this XDA guide and you should uh, download this package which will contain these two folders. Kingroot underscore Nokia X underscore mod and then Nokia X USB drivers. So these are not EXE, uh, the Nokia USB drivers is not EXE. So what you do is go into device manager, right click and hit update driver software. In over here, you can say like browse my computer for driver software and you can hit browse and then I'm gonna select the uh, folder on my desktop. Okay, let me see, uh, I have already have that on the downloads folder, so yeah, that is going to be the folder that you are seeing here. Let me hit next, okay, let me try that again, here you go. Uh, these are the USB drivers that I am selecting from my desktop, I hit next and it will install the driver software. So now the device is installed. You can see that in the device manager here, Nokia Composite ADB interface. Now all you have to do is open the Kingroot Superroot application. As you can see here, this is the Superroot EXE 837KB. You just double click that, hit yes. And what you see here is the Kingo Root app. So it will first wait uh, for you to connect your device. So what you do is plug out the USB and insert the USB again. Now this will automatically detect as the Nokia Composite ADB interface and this will start detecting the phone in a moment. So as you can see after a number of trial and error situations the Kingo Root app has gone into uh, ADB and now the root status is no. With one click you can root the device right now. So that's what we are going to do. The process uh, of routing is mentioned here and uh, it will install the Super SU app on the phone. So let's quickly root the phone now. So this, this is the process that it's uh, going to go through. So let's quickly skip past that and see the phone. Alright, so now the phone is rebooting as you can see the Nokia logo, the boot logo is here and it the Kingo root software says the root is succeeded and uh, please reboot, reboot your device to make it more stable. So that's what happened here and let's hit finish and let it connect again after the phone switches on. 
So as you can see the phone is already connected in the ADB mode and it will ask for a super user request once the phone is uh, booted. So let's see, uh, let's wait for that. So there you go, that's the phone after routing and you can see the super SU uh, software has been installed. So there seems to be an error here which is unrelated but still uh, that's the phone's uh, super SU. Let's open the super root app again which we can show uh, which will let you unroot if you want to. So as you can see on the screen it is asking for the ADB shell root request and I'm gonna grant it now. So after granting it you can see the Kingo root software lets you root again or remove the root. Now the root status is yes. So that's how we know the phone is rooted and of course the super SU software has been installed on the Nokia X. Now you can go ahead with the old tutorial and uh, do the installation of Google Apps like uh, Google services, Hangouts, YouTube and all that. So there you go, that's the quick tutorial for the Nokia X routing on software version 11.1. We'll let you know if it gets fixed again uh, with an update, uh, maybe there will be another root method. We'll let you know if that happens but for now this is the method and you can check out the XDA guide, the links are in the description below. Thanks for watching and let us know what you think in the comment section below. Do hit the like button if you found this tutorial helpful and please share it with your friends uh, if you found it really helpful. Anyway, subscribe to the channel for more videos like these. Thanks again.